Spark TV. Metal in action. So hi everybody out there, you are watching Spark TV Metal in action and I think you know these guys very well, that's Pontus and Joachim from Hammerfall. So hi guys, how are you? I'm very good, how are you? <laughs> very, very good to be here, man. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, of course, we have to talk about your new album. Uh, so we can start, of course, with the cover. There's a Hector once again. And there's a, some kind of meaning uh, with Hector. I mean, Hector is... It, it, it's always a meaning with yeah. Hector, I would say. I mean, for, in the first place, he was created to be like a mascot for the band. And uh, I don't think we ever realized how important he would be for the fans. Until... We yeah, released we the Infected album. <laughs> <laughs> apparently he was on vacation, so we had to uh, uh, swallow that from, from, from all the fans. But uh, about the Hector, uh, there is some uh, things on the cover like book and something what he is holding in his hand. Yeah, that, that came from... Uh, I wanted to have a different posture on Hector, because when we got the first uh, like the sketches for, for the artwork, he was standing in like a regular pose okay and we've seen that already more than once so we wanted to have him doing something else then I had an idea that we should use the uh, you know the, the lady justice okay yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. Yes, yes. holding the, the scales looking in a different direction that he's also some sort of a uh, you know judge and juror so to speak <laughs> that it, and he's a very powerful you know uh, individual Defenders, the I think uh, the sound uh, of the new one is totally classic. Uh, no, no experiments. Uh, no experiments. I sort of the whole the whole this, the whole thing of recording now. It's mm. a totally you know different thing from before. It's not like the like a, a producer that comes in and tells us how to do it or anything. We we brought back Fredrik Nordström, yeah, and uh, actually on the last album he he was involved and mixed the last album. But this album we, you know, he was more involved when it comes to designing, you know, the sound, you know, mic and drums, do, doing everything and being part of that. <clears throat> I think the sound it's it's back to the roots. It's more you know, yeah. most more straightforward. And I think that, but the songs has their has the story themselves, you know, to tell. And yeah. and I think you know, putting in tons of stuff in a production gets quite boring because I, I think all productions nowadays are like packed with information. Mm -hmm. This is more or less, you know, the song speaks for themselves. Mm -hmm. And you can still just go down to acoustic guitar and it works. Yeah. You don't need all the extras to make it work. And that's the performance and the energy that comes out when we play and we, we can just take it on stage and it's not going to be a problem with massive backtracks, massive stuff. Mm -hmm. You know, the production can be more or less back to basic. We are the greatest, keep on fighting. We'll take the shit we Vocally, what was the uh, hardest uh, song to sing? On the new album? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, if you were talking about that, you were uh, singing so high. Yeah, yeah. it's uh, <laughs> the Sacred Vow, uh, the lyric video that we released. Yeah. Because the, the chorus was not supposed to be sung by me, because we, we decided only to do it with the choir, because it's so damn high, you can't really sing up there. But in the studio, I was in such a great shape that day. It felt like I was, you know, breathing helium. I was on <laughs> cocaine and, and crystal meth and everything you at the were? same time. <laughs> I think so. Try to sing that fucking piece of shit. Otherwise, no. Uh, and what's the part? What's the part? How does it sound? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Good. Give me some helium. Give me some helium. <laughs> and I always try to renew myself when it comes to. Uh, you know, composing the vocal melodies. Okay, how should I approach this part? Mm -hmm. Ah, maybe I should actually go up even higher this time, which I did in a couple of songs. <laughs> I never sang as high as I did on, okay. on, on this album, so... Uh, yeah, I think there are a lot of new elements, and but the most important thing of all, 
it's still a lot of energy and even though we are mid 40s it sounds like a young hungry band spark tv metal in action